I can remember trying to put a guy's teeth back in when he fell off what was known as the blob out there beside what was the bar. It was the new bar when we were here, it's now closed. My fondest memory is probably coming towards the end of third year where you'd really found your friends by then. And because we did our exams at the end of the summer rather than at the start of the summer, the whole university was in shutdown while everybody else was studying and the commerce guys just partied like animals. I just remember those Monday morning lectures where they just put up with so much messing. I'm thinking, oh, is this what college is like? You know what I mean? Because they just, they didn't tell you what to do. They just gave the lecture and you suddenly realised, oh, we all have to be adults now? Okay. The 80s, there weren't a lot of job opportunities the year we graduated. I think a lot of people emigrated. There weren't a lot of Irish companies other than accountancy firms recruiting. So it was nearly brave to not go the accountancy route. When I left UCD, I went straight into the advertising profession. I was lucky enough to get an, a job in an advertising agency. And certainly uh, the BCom was a, a great uh, degree to have under my belt when I went into that. When I left college, I went first to Accenture for five years, and then I've worked in Irish software startups for the last 25 years, including my own one for the last 15 years. I worked for years for the European Commission in Eastern Europe. You had confidence, no matter what came up, you would have a foundation uh, to deal with anything. And I think a lot of us went on and did masters, sort of specialized afterwards, which I did in entrepreneurship. The BCom has had a huge impact on my career, and I would definitely encourage uh, my children to come and study in UCD. In fact, I'm hoping when the Leaving Cert works out, that my daughter will be doing business and law here next year, so fingers crossed on that. My daughter's applied to come here now in September, October, and I just, I wish I was her, you know, it's, fantastic, it's modern, it's vibrant. It looks like they're kind of at the cutting edge of what's going on in, in undergraduate study. Very impressed with how much it's changed, how it's developed. I mean, there's so much more here than there was in our time. John Teeling's classes were always very that. enjoyable, yeah, yeah. I always remember John Teeling actually saying to us, the student years are the time when you can misbehave, do all those silly things that you want to do, and uh, but once you start working, that's when you knuckle down. It's, but very different from the mid-80s when we were here. I do remember the trap where we used to go down and play pool. I don't even know if that exists anymore, but great, great facilities for the kids coming in these days. I think it's great it's going from strength to strength, and certainly abroad in America. I like the fact that they're doing so much work. Now you say UCD, and people have heard of it. Get out there, network, uh, enjoy yourself, find something you really enjoy doing and stick with it. Keep a really open mind about how your career can develop and don't allow yourself to become pigeonholed too early in your career. Because you spend three or four years in college, you'll spend 40 plus years working. Get the balance right and try and enjoy the journey.